so I've been reading on the forums about um, people who don't know what to do with their excess hydrogen and I've seen suggestions about a burner or a dumpster fire or something um, to get rid of it but it turns out that it's not necessary to, to go to any sort of extreme lengths to get rid of it I have a fix here on my quantum chip planet um, and this planet is currently producing uh, capable of producing 120 quantum chips per second I'm setting it up over here for 180 per second but currently 120 and the thing about these quantum chips is that one of the ingredients is casimir crystals and casimir crystals require a ton of hydrogen and if we go over here to the production of the casimir crystals you'll see that they require actually they require 12 hydrogen per crystal um, and of course these guys need to bring in a lot of hydrogen and they bring in from everywhere in the system um, but it turned out that they were not fast they were not bringing in the hydrogen fast enough so I had to add these extra towers here and uh, to, to bring in extra hydrogen simply to supply these towers with hydrogen and I also had them bring in optical grading crystals but then I realized that these guys could act as a sort of vacuum cleaners because I have a whole planet producing oil uh, refined oil and graphene and I realized that if you deselect this option where they cannot select from uh, or pick up from orbital collectors they will only pick up excess hydrogen from other planets so that does two things first of all is they get these guys will vacuum any excess hydrogen from anywhere in the cluster and the hydrogen will also this hydrogen will also be used first because it's closest so the local they will locally supply these towers here so in this way it doesn't matter how much hydrogen you produce anywhere else you will never produce uh, 170 or 1000 hydrogen now um, per minute by doing anything else i am currently producing um, i think it's 14700 white cubes per second so i, I think I'm, i can say i'm i'm pretty late game uh, because i I've, I've seen on the forum that some people will say oh you don't know like late game hydrogen is a problem uh, no 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 it's not you fix it like this um, i i will recognize that early on uh, in the beginning where you need uh, hydrogen to produce the red cubes you have too much oil and then later when you want to use the oil for uh, purple cubes you will usually have too much hydrogen so you need to find a way to balance it at that point maybe destroy it or whatever it doesn't really matter because you have infinite supply of it but later in the game once you start producing these quantum chips this is the solution you set up these vacuum cleaners these towers here of course let it produce as, as much as you can or uh, give it as much power as you can and then simply have these guys vacuum your cluster for hydrogen. You can actually see 10,000 being brought in from, well, somewhere, right? 8,000, 8,000. But they will prioritize this. And so I've been checking my, my planet where I produce the oil and graphene, and it never gets to sit there. Like, I've never seen it above 1,000 because it instantly disappears into these towers here. So I, I think this is a good and permanent solution to the hydrogen problem. Let me know if you have any questions, uh, ask in the comments or yeah, bye.